Alright, so this will be a quick one. I did a speed test with the OWC Thunderbolt hub. I have a unboxing and overview clip here. So I used a Samsung T5. Yes, I know it's not the fastest or newest SSD, but it's well known and used everywhere. So it's a nice baseline or base level to compare stuff to. I used a 2018 Mac Mini and a 2020 Mac Mini M1 for that test. And as you can see, speeds are good. Yes, it's a bit faster directly connected and it is a bit slower on the M1 Mac Mini, but it's all right. It's still quite fast and quite solid. No connection issues or whatsoever. So everything is nice. I also did a test with the Call Digit TS3 Plus to see how that compares. And I was surprised that with the Call Digit TS3 Plus, it is actually quite slower. But keep in mind, this box, even though it has quite a few connections, is solid, well made and mm, well known and used everywhere as well. It does translate, so to speak, Thunderbolt to USB-C. And in this test, I did test it on a slower USB-C 5 gig connection. Okay, so there you have it. But keep in mind, one important thing is, if you want to use that OWC Thunderbolt hub on older Intel Macs, you have to run the latest macOS Big Sur. It doesn't work with Catalina and everything before that. You have to have macOS 11 running on that system. Otherwise, it doesn't even show up. So, anyways, that's it about this video. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions about that or let me know what you use to connect all your SSDs and stuff like that or what your experience is with other USB hubs or Thunderbolt hubs or what you use. That would be appreciated. Anyways, see you in the next one. Cheers.